Momo is one of the most popular dishes in Nepal. Yo momo, ek plate, dui plate, tin plate khanda apne pet dukhe ko aur momo se baasi. They are bite-sized dumplings made with a spoonful of stuffing wrapped in dough. Ya sab hai cha, ramro cha. And this is MNS Hunger Hunt. Watching MNS Hunger Hunt, and on this episode, we're at Gaushala, and today we're gonna stop ourselves with not in Daiko Momos. This famous and old place has been here for quite some time now, and they serve delicious momos. But what is it that makes these momos so good that people from all over the city come here to satisfy their momo cravings? Let's find out, yeah. Look at this crowd, it's amazing. I had to wait in the line to eat. I mean, it's crazy. Did you have a coupon? Yes. I'm going to eat a little bit of momo. How much is it? 120. Thank you. So, this is a self-service place. You need to get your coupons first. This is my coupon. I'm going to go get my momo. Momos are usually steamed, though they are sometimes fried or steam fried. The fillings of meat or vegetables become succulent as it produces an intensively flavored broth sealed inside the wrappers. But here they serve the best local buff momos. So this is the momo dip, the hero of the entire dish. Momos. Wow, smells so good. Comments on us are all the blooms of Borneo. Since this dish is popular among the Newar community of Kathmandu Valley, one prevalent belief is that Newari traders brought momo techniques from Lhasa to Tibet. However, the momo has since evolved to suit the Nepali palate. So good right now. You know what? There's nothing such as bad momos. Momos that go beneath me. So, but I love these momos because you see, the outer layer is not very dense. It's not dense at all, and the mince stuffings is full of meat. There's like more meat and less onions, which makes it even more tasty. And one inside the mouth, it just oozes with all that meat juice. And not to forget the dip. It's sour. It's spicy. And goes perfectly with the momos. Wow. I'll go get myself another plate of momo. Until then, you enjoy the ambience and find out how the momos are prepared here. The dough is rolled very thin. The filling is placed in the center, and then the momo is shaped and sealed into small packets leaving some space for it to fill with broth that collects during the steaming process. Voila! My second plate! And for this one, I'm not going to speak too much. I'm going to see you after I finish my good old momos. Yeah, momo, I'm going to eat it. I'm going to eat it. I'm going to eat it. मेरो तेतीस साल बड़ा शुरू भाग है तेतीस साल देखि को मैं यो मोमो पसल को नाम राखे तेतीस साल मोमो पसल राख्ता खेल दुई रुपये प्लेट देखि को कुपन सिस्टम तेतीस साल देखि बना को अलग लगभग उन्चालीस वर्ष भो यहाँ सब फैमिली फैमिली मत हो बनाने यहाँ हमें मसंग गली यहाँ सारे पचास साल देखि को हम मोमो चाहिए पैल्य देखि ना मिठो भाग भर अ मिठाई नारायण दाई भाई मेरे श्रीमान हो मैं वहाँ को श्रीमती 
मेरो चिरमान बीते को आइले 22 वर्ष भायो रापन मेरो छोरी अरले सबे मिलेर पसल चलाई रहे था छोरी अरले घर था मले के ये नो पढ़ देना मले आनंद था so next time you pray for momos, you know where to come, right? And getting here too is pretty easy. You can take the road that leads to Ratapol from Gaushalat Chok and 100 meters from there, on your left, you find the restaurant. So guys, seems like this is the wrap for today. I'll see you next week with another episode of MNS Hunger Hunt. Until then, keep smiling, stay healthy and keep eating. Bye!